Hello and welcome to Black Hat PC. Today we have an Inspron 5570. We are going to do a battery replacement. Uh, we'll also have a look at a few other components whilst we're in there. First off, by turning your laptop over. Um, I've already unscrewed. No one wants to watch me unscrew a load of screws. Um, you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine larger screws of around this size and one smaller screw let's get that on camera it goes just there make note of that when you take it apart then we turn the machine over open it up and we go around the edge just lift it away from the base Everything's mounted to the palm rest in this particular machine. And turn it back over. And then lift from the front. And there we go. That's the back plate. All right. Here we got the battery. Customer was complaining because over the last year or so it slowly started depreciating losing its lifespan um it's it's had a good few years it's a 2000 and what year is that 2018 battery so we'll first of all disconnect the battery And we'll take the what should be four screws, but I can see there one's missing. This has probably been opened before. And take the battery out. Need to take the cable off as well. You'll be surprised how many customers preemptively remove their battery from their laptop, knowing they've got another one coming, and they throw it out. Throw this away as well. Make sure you keep that. Then I'll just get another battery from stock. There we go. Right. And we need to, just in this slot, just at the end here, the black end goes into the battery. Then we pop it back in place and there we go connect us back in three screws will be fine for this I haven't got any more in stock unfortunately otherwise I would replace the extra one there you see with this back laptop you do have an NVMe SSD drive there. You can get the extended life battery, um, part number 33YDH. This battery that we're installed in now is part number WDX0R. It's a 42 watt hour. And it's 11.4 volts. But the extended life one, if you have um, a 2.5 inch SSD in your machine, you won't be able to get the extended card unless you do upgrade to a um, M.2 card, NVMe. Other things we sell for this laptop, charging port, very common for these to go wrong. Um, Center pin can get damaged through wear or just heavy use. Um, and the other issue you could be facing is you may be getting the plugged in not charging error or a communication error with the PC. Um, They'll have three communication channels, the BIOS, the battery, and the adapter. If there's something wrong there, you'll get an error. Don't always tell you very clearly what the error is, but it's always replacing the adapter first. One moment. You should visually inspect your adapter. Here's a new one. This is part number MGJN9. We also have this on our website. It's a 65 watt. What normally gets damaged 
is the center pin just in here probably not going to get it on camera because it's very fine oh yeah you can see it slightly um check the cable make sure there's no kinks they normally have around this end or here just here um and obviously make sure this is plugged in you could also uh check the fuse in the plug if it's not a molded plug Whilst we're in the machine, um, I'll actually show you how to replace the DC port. Um, like I said, it's a very, very common issue. Disconnect your battery. On the hinge here, take the three screws holding it down. Then lift the bracket, can be a bit stiff. Then we unscrew the tiny little screw just next to the port. Then this cable, just root it under the LAN card there. And there we go. We have these on the website. When you lower the hinge, make sure you don't crush the cables. Then replace the three screws. Right, now we've got to remember to plug the battery back in. Not going to lie, I've forgot that a few times. We've all done it. Right, all back together. We also sell the um, BIOS battery. I think I'm going to get them back on the website soon. Can get hold of other parts for this laptop and similar models. All I've got to do now is put the screws back in. Right, thanks for watching.